what is going on yeah so today we are gonna try something um that i really haven't seen online i might have to fly over to new babbage first but uh yeah i want to see what ground vehicles actually fit in the freelancer so what i would like to do is i want to know what kind of ground vehicles actually fit inside the freelancer all right, so we're here at New Babbage. I'm just gonna launch and gonna head our way over to the garage. See what vehicles we can fit in there. I don't know what we're gonna start off with. You know, uh, let's try a tumbler or a tumbrel. Vehicles let's try the cyclone. The I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, uh, maybe. No, yeah? Oh, that's awesome. Oh, that's a squeeze. <laughs> uh. Oh, my gosh. I'm actually really surprised that it fit in here. Okay, let's see how much room's in the front. Okay, you know what? This is going to change. This is going to change things. Definitely going to change things. All right, so we got one vehicle in there. And uh, let's go ahead and see what else we can put in here. So let's see if I can get out. It's going to be interesting. Okay. Now, the question is, can I get to one side more? Yeah, it looks like I can. Okay, let's try that. I think that'll work. Yeah, yeah, that'll work. Okay, we got room there. We got room there. Okay, we're good. All right, nice. Okay. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, just have to shove it all the way one side. That's okay, because we have another exit right here. Okay. Okay, let's try putting one more vehicle in. Uh, we're going to try that RLC. This one here, which is really convenient because it, you get into it from the front. So what's going to make things a lot easier with this one is that uh, you actually get into it through the front. So if we went nose in, if it were just loading this one up, then it would, you know, we'd get out. And then we would go right up through the door. Uh, or in this case, what I'm going to do is I'm going to back this vehicle up. What the heck's going on here? Okay, interesting. You are clear to launch. Oh, sweet. I just want to see if that worked. <laughs> Instead of uh, pressing F12. All right, let's get this thing in there. Oops. Not very fast, but that's fine. What the heck's going on here? What? Does this vehicle not have no ground clearance? It doesn't look like it. 
doesn't. Interesting. So how is this a mining vehicle if there's no ground clearance? Okay, no, there is. It shows you. I, I'm confused. Anyways, okay, whatever. be too wide uh, too wide no yeah no it's good there we go okay and let's get out So the only problem is with this particular vehicle because of how wide it is, if anyone, if you have your crew here, needed to get in to the to the cargo area, to the turret, uh, you won't be able to. All right, so with this great news about being able to put these two vehicles inside, and I'm super slippery here. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, if you had like a, a one of those hover bikes, you'd be able to definitely put them in here. At least one, maybe even two. No, you'd be able to put two in here, I think. I don't have, but uh, yeah, definitely. Okay, so now we can just close up. Like I was saying, unfortunately, we're not going to be able to move our way to to the front of the ship through the cargo area because of that ROC and how wide it is. But one nice thing about the Freelancer is that we have another way of getting into the ship, which is right here. You know what? The Freelancer, I think it's one of the underrated uh, ships. It's a really nice ship to begin with. Second of all, being able to fit these two vehicles inside... For gameplay, making this ship to become a very capable ship. Not only that, like I said, this cargo area that we have is pretty significant. And we can put some uh, some some cargo stuff in here. Also having uh, four beds in here as a bunk. It's going to turn this into a, I think, a, a nice ship to be used in 3.23. Alright, hope you enjoyed the video. That is it for today. Um, yeah, so that'll be a good, this is a good reference. Oh, what the heck's going on here? Yeah, so hopefully that, uh, that gives you guys a good reference on the Freelancer on, and how capable this thing is. And I'm going to have to admit, that was a really good parking job. <laughs> Holy Mac. Anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. Alright, if this is the kind of thing you like to see, why don't you think about subscribing? Don't forget to hit the notification bell so that way you are notified for every time we release a new video. Until the next time, who knows, maybe we'll see you in the verse.